Hey everybody, QuintLearsNewHomesales.com. I'm here with Ashley Kent with Kent Homes. Thanks so much for joining us. Of course, Quint. Thanks for having me. So Ashley is a heavy hitter in the home building industry, and you just did a big, huge accomplishment. Professional Builder Magazine, 40 under 40. Huge congratulations. How was it? How did it feel to receive that? Thank you, Quint. I'm really honored to to receive the award. I'm really looking forward to getting out to San Francisco here in a, in a month or so. Yeah. It's a huge accomplishment, and she's a rising star in the home building industry. What makes Ashley unique and special is you have, a, 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 I would say, a different perspective because you've done so many things in the home building industry at a very young age. Um, talk to me about when you started within the home building industry, where you started. Okay, so really I started about four years ago. I've kind of worked my way through the company. Um, so I really started warranty, so that customer service aspect um, of the home building process. And then about a year there, uh, I went into project management, so, so really as a superintendent. So really from uh, the first footing in the ground to finishing that orientation walk list, um, I was the day-to-day -day contact for all of our trades and then also for the homeowners. Um, and then really in October of 2015, I uh, went into new home sales um, where I got to work with Bob Schultz and learn um, you know, how to be successful as a new home salesperson. Um, so, you know, had a great first year, did that till uh, August of this past year, so 2017. Now I have two salespeople underneath me managing a team. Um, so that's kind of how I've progressed. So I've really kind of learned um, from the back forward, so to say. So from the, you know, the last contact from the homeowner all the way to the front here with uh, new home sales and marketing. And that's not all. You're actually a speaker here at the event. We're at the Best Home Building Practices Summit, and you are one of the keynotes. Talk to me about what you're going to be talking about with the, the audience. Right. So um, I'm going to be doing a workshop this afternoon with Bob Schultz um, on generating um, prof profit generating profit metrics. So basically, we're going to be going over two things, really. Uh, the first will be uh, sales projections, so how we come up with those, um, which there's a process involved in that. And then also we're going into a new community, um, so how we evaluate all the home sites, how we're going to price them, uh, creating that scarcity and that urgency to really kick off the, the project. What I think is unique is your perspective coming from so many different angles. I mean, why do Because in, in sales, you said it was a little bit successful, but how many homes did you sell? How many families did you help? Right. So my first year, I did 54, 54 sales, so... That, that's huge. I mean, that's not a small feat. I mean, just to go from from this to that. How were you successful in new home sales? What were some of your techniques? Give me some content that could help the front lines. Yeah, I mean, I think the first thing was that I was very mendable because I didn't have it, all these bad habits. So I came in and really embraced, um, you know, the new home sales process, embraced going through, um, you know, not being scared to ask for the sale. Um, so, I mean, it, it was really learning as much as I can on Bob's system, implementing it on a day-to-day -day basis. So being open to the convenience of the customer. What's the biggest challenge that you, uh, you were, what's the biggest surprise going from construction to sales that you, you were saying, oh, wow, I didn't realize this? Oh, the biggest surprise. Um, I think in general, just these preconceived notions of sales. Um, and like everyone has this, um, you know, bad taste or, in their mouths about salespeople, but being there and being genuine and trying to really help someone uh, get into the new home they want at the best possible price, uh, really, you know, stepping up to the plate and trying to change that perception of what a new home salesperson, um, you know, may be perceived as from a buyer. Do you think your, your, your background as a service person and as a home builder, like talk about like the importance of product knowledge, does that play into it or is it to service or what, what's the combination? I mean, I definitely think the product knowledge helps. So really when someone asks if they can bump out a room two feet, knowing kind of what's behind the wall, I definitely think that helps. And that's really was very unique um, and a part of what made me successful. But I think really just understanding that there's a process that you need to follow, just like you need blueprints, excuse me, uh, to build a home, to have blueprints of how to sell and how to go through that process, um, you know, was very beneficial to me. I would imagine you would like catch people off guard because you know like oh it's a living room oh this uh, this is the kitchen right and then you're like no this the you know you you can talk, I mean, you know it better than you know you're a builder right right so I definitely had a bunch of people who were like really you know you had like your I was like yeah like boots on shorts the whole nine so I uh, definitely took a lot of people by surprise just with my age and and that knowledge of construction um, I definitely think it played into my into my favor um, but but yeah definitely surprised a lot of people with that. Well, we love what you're doing. We're rooting. We're super proud of you. I know your family's proud. You're, you know, you 
Ken Holmes is doing some really cool things. Um, what's next? Because, I mean, you're, 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 it's almost like, okay, have we reached out? Are you going to go from, what, what, what's next for Ashley Kent? Right. So uh, currently, like I said, I'm the VP of our sales and marketing team. So I've really enjoyed uh, learning that new aspect of the business. But I definitely want to get a very well-rounded um, approach to all the other parts of the business because the overall goal is to, to buy my dad out, buy the company, own the company, manage it on a day-to-day -day basis. So uh, we've got a plan for that. After that <laughs> world domination, we, uh, why, why do you have to dominate the entire world? <laughs> Come on, Quint. <laughs> No, but I'm super so um, you're going to, to uh, PCBC yes. with uh, 40 under 40. It's going to be an awesome thing. Any any shout outs of encouragement? Just being on so many different, it's, you're fascinating because of the, all the different aspects that you have. What encouragement would you have for the front lines? I would really just say stay hungry and driven and really committed to the process and just constant improvement. Never be, um, never think you know it all because you definitely don't. <laughs> right. And then, and then you, you, something interesting, you, you brew your own beer? I do, I do. My favorite is IPA, so if you ever want to try an India Pale Ale, I can help you out there. But yeah, I enjoy doing that in my free time when I, ha you know, when I have it. It takes about a day, but enjoy doing that. Panthers fan? Big Panthers fan. Well, look, we're excited to have you on the program. Keep your eye out on cash. You, you, if you're not already, you need to be involved with the home building industry because you're going to make a huge impact. Um, and how do we connect with you? Thank you. Uh, thank you, Quint. Uh, basically, uh, we have a LinkedIn page, Ashley Kent on there, Kent Holmes. You can find me. All right, man. Keep your eyes on this person. Rising star in the home building industry. Super proud to have you on the program. Thank Th you for having me. Thank you. We're looking forward to your, your talk here at the Best Home Building Practices Summit with Ashley Kent. Take care. Thank you.